On the occasion of World Menstrual Hygiene Day, we bring to you a story of women who are working hard to create awareness about the importance of hygiene. Diane, a social activist from Mumbai, has started an initiative called Red is the New Green, under which sanitary pad dispensing machines and in, have been installed in multiple schools across the city. The initiative aims to eliminate the taboos associated with menstruation. So with women, it's very important that they first be able to talk about it in our society because periods are regarded as a big taboo not many women are comfortable talking about it and as a result we have to make an effort to reach out to our own community the young ones or our elders to be able and let's start talking about it the most important thing is that and another thing is that we realize that it's expensive to buy pads some people cannot afford it and there are a lot of people who are using cloth pads still so what we do is we teach them how to use it better, show them the other options available, make sure they have access to cheaper and better pads. So she managed to get uh, three actually, so we put two in our school and we said we'll share this one with one more school of ours in Bandra. So we put it up last June, a school just began and uh, we had orientation for the children, class by class, they were happy about it. The teachers, we prepared some card for them, so they had a card so that they could track them uh, period the month after month. They were given a very decent pouch where they could carry it, so they were not feeling shy to carry it in their hand. So we really did it well and they were very happy. The teachers also were using it. And the entire year we bought a couple of them, the boxes that we get. And we've noticed that children are today much more regular than before. And it has also affected the whole culture among the work because even our ladies to clean the bin would, uh, it is a little unclean to put it, and even disposing to put it you know, in a dustbin and then it's taken by anybody. There's so many things connected to it. So now that we know it's disposed of hygienically, we also feel happy about it. And the whole surrounding is different today. Let's talk to some women here and know what are their opinions about it. sanitary napkin use karte hain aur aapko is bare mein kab jankari mili? वे जब भी होने लगे तभी मैं कपड़ा ही यूज़ करने लगे वे जब भी बच्चा हो गया तभी हॉस्पिटल में खाली दो दिन प्यार दिया और डॉक्टर लोग ने बस प्यार मेरे को नहीं जमता है कपड़ा ही यूज़ करते हाँ अभी भी वही करते तो आपके आसपास की जो दूसरी औरतें हैं उन आपको लगता है अभी भी जो पैड या सैनिटरी नैपकिन वो इतना ईजिली अवेलेबल है या वो खरीदते हैं या अभी भी कपड़ा यूज़ करते हैं मेरे देवरानी और और सब लोग प्यार ही यूज़ करते हैं मैं खाली आके रख कपड़ा यूज़ करते हैं और मेरे अभी लड़की होने लगी वो प्यार यूज़ करते हैं मैम आप बताइए आपके हिसाब से आप क्या प्रेफर करती हैं यूज़ करना और कितने अवेयर हैं आपके आसपास की भी जो औरतें हैं प्यार या और कुछ ज़्यादा करके सब लोग प्यार यूज़ करते हैं हम लोग के जवाने में तो नरम नरम कपड़ा जो रहता था वो यूज़ करते थे हाँ और यही करते थे आपको लगता है ये हाइजीनिक तरीका था पहले जो यूज़ करते थे अब ज़्यादा हाइजीनिक आप तो कोई नहीं कपड़ा यूज़ करता ऐसा ही कोई करता नहीं तो सबको पैटी चाहिए तो आपने कभी किन 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 लोगों को या औरतों को देखा है जो शायद महंगाई की वजह से इसे यूज़ नहीं करते हैं या वो अवेयर नहीं है कि ये भी कुछ तो हाँ अभी कम बजट है नहीं हो पा रहा अभी किसी किसी को फर्स्ट डे ही फोर फोर टू फाइव टू पैड लगेगा तो तो कम्फर्ट नहीं हो पाएगा इसके कारण उन लोग कपड़ा यूज़ कर दें so as you heard from all these women and the activists on this world menstrual hygiene day how important it is for the women in our country to be aware about the hygiene issues and also the overall understanding of what a menstrual cycle is apart from this the women also spoke about how they want that the government take some initiative when it comes to the availability of sanitary napkins and other methods of protection in the market which they feel is still very expensive expensive and inaccessible to them. This is Richard Sharma for Mirror Now Mumbai.